For this problem, we want to find the indefinite integral. So we're asked to find the integral of 2x plus 3 over square root of 2x plus 1 dx. So we know there's a composition in this problem, so that means integration by substitution. So I go for my list for integration by substitution. What I have to do first is I target the inside of the composition. So that's going to be the function we evaluate first if we stick numbers in. In this case, it's going to be 2x plus 1. So I'm going to set that equal to my u. My next step, we're going to take the derivative of this, which is 2. And then the rule is du equals that derivative times dx. So we have du equals 2 dx. I can isolate dx. So I wind up with dx equals du over 2. We move all of these into our formula. Du be dx becomes du over 2. Square root of 2x plus 1 becomes u to the 1 half. We might as well get rid of the radical sign now. Then we're left with a 2x plus 3 in the top, which needs to be worked on. So can we get rid of 2x plus 3? We look at what we have from our substitution, and I notice 2x is equal to u minus 1. So I could even go so far as to solve for x by itself, but we're only asked for 2x, so why don't we just stop at 2x? I could put a u minus 1 in here, so I get u minus 1 plus 3 over u to the 1 half du over 2, and we notice everything is in u, so we're good to go. Okay, the top becomes u plus 2 over u to the 1 half, and then we have du over 2. If I want to simplify, first note the 2 comes out as 1 half, not as 2, because there's, this is in the bottom. It has to stay on the bottom when we pull it out. So there's an imaginary or hidden 1 sitting in the top here, so we're going to have 1 half. Now if I divide u to the 1 half into each of these, this is u to the 1, so the idea is going to be bring that up as a minus a half, and then that's 1 minus a half, which gives me a half for the exponent on the first term. For the second term, just remember, I flip it up, it becomes a minus sign, so I get u to the minus 1 half times r2. So this is the thing I want to integrate, and we know how to do that since we know how to do exponents. So the rule is, we add 1 to our 1 half, which gives me 3 halves, and I flip it over. Here we add 1 to minus 1 half, which gives me 1 half. Flip it over gives me a 2, so this becomes a 4. Note, I want parentheses on everything on this side of the integral sign, otherwise we'll distribute this incorrectly, and that will mess our final answer up. So, pushing the 1 half through is going to give me 1 third, 2x plus 1 to the 3 halves, plus 2, 2x plus 1 to the 1 half, after I get rid of the u by putting in 2x plus 1. And then we add a constant. Now that I have my answer, we should check it if we have time. The way we check, I take the derivative of my answer that better agree with the integrand of our original integral. So let's take the derivative. 3 halves comes down, becomes 1 half, we drop the exponent by 1, gives me 1 half. Chain rule says multiply by derivative of the inside. We get a 2 out in, front, in the back. On this term, the 1 half comes down, gets rid of the 2. We drop the exponent by 1, and then we take the derivative of the inside by the chain rule, and we get a 2. Constant term goes away. Now we just have to clean this up. The 2 goes away with the 1 half. I'm going to rewrite my 1 half exponent as a radical. Over here, we're going to have a 2, but the minus 1 half says we can do a radical, but we have to also push it to the bottom because of the minus sign. So notice here, we want to turn this into one term. So what I need to do is get a square root of 2x plus 1 and the denominator on this side. The way we do that is multiply by 1 but 1 is going to be the form square root of 2x plus 1 over itself. And note, I can rewrite the original 2x plus 1 as square root of 2x plus 1 over 1. 
Okay, carry all the second term around. Now notice here, I multiply through. These are going to turn into 2x plus 1. I have a 2 over here. And everything's over, square root of 2x plus 1, square root. So when I combine, we notice we get the original integrand, so we're home free.